Hey everybody. So today I want to pose a question uh, to Christians out there. So, and that would be, what does it mean to be a Christian? I think a lot of us thinks it means one thing um, when it really doesn't. I myself actually do not like the term. Um, I haven't used it and over the past few years, four years or so, um, I felt drawn away from it. And here's my reason why. So I believe that the term Christian is a stagnant term. It's not like follower of Christ. It's not a verb. You're not following Christ. It's not an active thing that you're doing. It's this kind of stagnant state of being. I'm just a Christian. Um, and really, that's just identifying yourself as part of a religion, really. You're just saying, like, I'm a Christian. So is it really any better than saying, you know, I'm a Pharisee, I'm a Sadducee, you know, I'm a Baptist, I'm a Presbyterian. I, this is what I am. This is what I identify myself as. So it's more of an identity, really, than it is an action. And that's why I prefer the term follower of Christ. And I don't like getting bogged down by Christianity and the constraints that I feel like um, have been placed upon it and the parameters. So my advice to you today would just be ask yourself truly who you are and what you want to be. Do you want to be an active follower of Christ? Good, then be that. It doesn't mean that you can't be a Christian or identify yourself as a Christian, is it? My thing is just don't let a term be something that stops you from being active and, you know, a follower of Christ and someone who is a person of action, not just someone who sits in a pew and listens. Um, be someone who goes out and challenges things and speaks boldly for the name of Christ and defends the God who created you and then the God who gave his son, his one and only son, to save you. These are huge gifts. We wouldn't be here if it wasn't for God and then we wouldn't be saved from the perils of death if it wasn't for his son. So we owe everything to him. So we have no excuse not to be active. And that's today's message. See you all next time.